I made my own notes from step one. And what I did was integrated my new notes that I made from UWorld for third year into my step one notes or vice versa. Made notes for third year and I kind of threw in a lot of my step one notes that correlated with the same organ systems so I could keep reviewing that pathophysiology and pharmacology with my third year notes. So as for your daily schedule, I've noticed two types of students that have these two different types of schedules. Some people have extremely time consuming clinicals. It's where they're always at the hospital. They have very little time to study. And the other type is people that have very light clinical schedules. And these two types of schedules are the opposite, but they're both extremely beneficial if you use it to your advantage. So no matter what kind of schedule you have, we're all working towards the same goal and we're all working extremely hard for this year. I just want to kind of give you the big picture of how your clerkship should go about, how your routine should go for each clerkship. And it's all kind of the same. So I just want to give an example of, say, psychiatry. So you start your psychiatry rotation. The first thing you should do, obviously you should already have UWorld uh, purchased at least for that year. And you should go to your rotation, right? Learn, see the patients, learn from your attendees, kind of jot down the diseases you saw, the, the managements you saw. And then when you get home that night, you should do at least, I mean, five to 15 UWorld questions, depending on your medical knowledge. The more you know uh, from step one, the less you'll have to learn on CK for management. So I would do those questions and you do this every day, same routine every day, do the questions, annotate into your review book if you have one, or if you wanna make brand new notes and annotate into those notes. And then you keep going, right? So you do this for the six weeks of your rotation for psych. And then at the end of the rotation, our shorter term goal is we're studying for that shelf, right? I need to do good on that shelf because there's a huge correlation on how you do on shelves versus how you do on your exam. So you must study for those shelves during your psych rotation, for example. A lot of the learning kind of depends on where your knowledge exists right now, because everyone's been studying for two years. Everyone's knowledge base is a little different. Some people may be able just to do questions and they can do well on them, except for some management stuff and they can learn as they go. Others may need to go back and review some pathophysiology and review some diseases to make a diagnosis. So for those students, I would really recommend doing UWorld questions along with your review book and annotating it. And if you dedicate your days to this year, you will definitely be successful.